Hey guys, um, pretty sure this is going to be my last video before I go. So, um, sorry if it's really noisy around here. My African gray is going crazy. Calm down, buddy. There we go. Um, so this is what I got today, I guess you could say. Um, apparently this guy was selling some disabled turtles at a cheaper price. Uh, read your sliders. He had a, uh, I think, I'm not sure with turtle morphs, but there was a, uh, orange colored snapping, um, it was an alligator snapping, I think. Um, it was like orange color and it only had one eye. Now let's just see over here. By the way, guys, this is his little tiny little feeding tub since, well, you'll know in a second why he has a small feeding tub. Okay, so, go. let's see if we could focus, we have a strong one, this is a strong guy, he's pushing on my fingers really hard, there we go, this is a blind eyeless pastel ready slider. Um, you can see that he is pretty healthy. He's very alert. Um, not super fat, but apparently he does eat. If not, I will hand feed him myself. I'm just... he. Li I literally just got that, like, five minutes ago. So, just trying. As you can see, he can move around my hand. He's pushing pretty hard. And uh, he was climbing all over the sides and everything, and um, he's just very alert. And uh, yeah, guys, whoops, sorry, one second. Whoops. So I don't have to worry about this light shining into him because since he has no eyes, it's not really gonna hurt. Uh, as you guys, I named him a Slender because he does look like Slender Man. You know what I mean? This turtle is born literally without eyes. Like you can see there are no indents or anything on the face. There's just no eyes. Everything else is normal. His mouth's kind of crooked onto one side. Um, his tail's fine. His shell. Oops. It's like, ah, he's crawling out. Uh, there we go. His shell is perfectly fine. Uh, not the best pastel I've seen, but he's pretty nice. And, um, he's just moving around in the water. You see? He's pretty alert if I poke him. I know this sounds mean, but, you know, you gotta check if a turtle's alert or anything. If he crawls around himself. And everything, he was, he, he was like, climbing on the sides, like, going upwards. Just a few minutes ago. But yeah, guys, this is my blind eyeless... Ready slider turtle. For those of you who are saying, oh, you take in disabled animals because you enjoy it, this is so cruel. First of all, I want to make sure all of you understand that nobody breeds these out. Like, same with my Siamese and my two headed turtles. It's not genetically inheritable. So, nobody purposely breeds these guys out for them to actually turn out this way. Um, for some reason, they are favorable. Like, the Siamese and two headed. Which I am sort of glad because, you know, whoever can actually afford to buy them, obviously can afford to care for them properly. So, that's one. And, um, this eyeless turtle, uh, he was sold at a pretty cheap price. And, obviously, because he's blind. And, um, I got him. I actually paid, I, I managed to pay half price because, uh, that guy was generous. Um, he paid, he gave me half price of what the original price he put, offered it as. And the reason why I took it in is because I've he's actually been putting it on lease for quite a while now. For like at least a month. And nobody has taken him. So, I've decided to take in him. You know, if it means that from every single day I'll have to like wiggle some fruit pellets or some dried shrimps in front of his face for him to eat, I'll do my best. And um... Tonight, I think I'm just going to leave him in this little tub just to get used to. Tomorrow, I'll move him into a normal red air slider tank with like a floater. 
heater and filter and um, places for him to swim. So far, this is how his previous owner has um, kept him. So it's a new environment. We'll let him stay in somewhere more familiar. Um, as you can see, the water level is not too high. Reason being for that is because um, because he's blind. I actually tested it just now, like where I put high water level. He tends to be like squirming around everywhere and like bashing into places and everything because he's so noxious about swimming around and he doesn't know where he's going obviously because he can't see um they can when actually calm down and eat properly so this is how i'll feed him and this is pretty much how you're supposed to feed blind turtle anyways so yeah guys um yeah another member to my reptile rehabilitation for those who are disabled now i have a one-eyed ball python and now a eyeless turtle so yeah guys this is slender still a beautiful boy girl whatever it is and yeah guys thanks for watching see he's climbing on the sides thanks for watching guys bye